Hello Air Signs, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius. Thank you for tuning into your weekly tarot reading. This is going to be a reading to see what's coming up for you in the week ahead. So we do have a fresh new week ahead. Um, before I begin, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, and if you are after a private reading with me, you can email me and I will send you over the details. If you'd like to go ahead and book. Um, Otherwise, this is intended for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. And of course, if you're dealing with an air sign, this is going to be helpful as well. We'll see what the um what the weekly predictions are um, for you. Okay, let's give the cards a good shuffle and see what comes up. Your messages for air signs, please. They need to know this week. Okay, there's light at the end of a tunnel in a situation we've got the rainbow coming out for you um, which I really like because I feel like in the recent past there's been some things that you've been sort of struggling with um, and you know you're trying to sort of make sense of it all air signs and you're trying to piece it all together um, but I like this because I feel like you're coming out of something through the other side so slowly slowly you're actually getting this is like a positive reinforcement message so I feel like slowly slowly baby steps things are coming together here for you and i feel like i'm i'm getting the word outcome is coming up here so i feel like if you've been waiting on some news um or you've been waiting on something to be delivered or a verdict of some kind or an, uh, an outcome of a relationship i feel like this is coming up for you in the week ahead um so you know things things have been a bit stormy um, things have been a bit, you know, you've been trying to weather this storm and it's it's really taken a lot of your energy. Um, it's really put you in that two of swords kind of energy, which is actually you're coming up as the two of swords. So I feel like, you know, this is like the dark crows that are taking away what looks like this kite. So I feel like you didn't have control of a situation or you felt like, one day the universe is taking you this way the next day your thoughts are taking you another way so things have been super confusing for you you know you've been trying to manage all of this um i feel like you're doing a great job so i want to say you know give yourself a pat on the back and know that whatever it is that you're going through it's a lot it's been a lot for you uh and i feel like sort of what's governing that is the ten of wands so there's like a heaviness you've been trying to i get that you've been maybe like hiding out going mia you haven't sort of been social maybe and i feel like this week i think that's that probably is going to carry on but i think you're going to see more positivity um in the situation here um okay i actually see you reaching out to someone i don't know if it's like a friend or a family member it could be could be an earth sign i feel like there's an earth sign that's going to want to come to your aid and they're going to want to help you so this could be that taurus capi virgo so they're going to come forward and they're going to try help you i see help given or help received um because they know okay this person is like very in tune with what you're going through and they they know that you haven't sort of been yourself lately but this is a big contrast to go from the two of swords to the ten of cups um this is emotional fulfillment that's coming here that you haven't had in a very very long time or you haven't felt in um felt in quite a while we also have the hierophant here so this is taurian energy so it could be someone you work with um i'm getting like a work love thing that's blossoming this week so you might be meeting someone through work or it's someone you work with and it's originally a work relationship but it's it's gonna sort of lean more towards something more romantic so whoever it is they're picking up on the drama um 
And as I'm saying this, I'm looking outside as I'm saying this, and I can see in the trees there's just like this group of magpies and crows just swarming the trees. So I feel like, yeah. And as I said that, they fly away. Um, okay, I do feel like you're taking flight and I do feel like things are moving forward. Um, but you know, this dark crows that I'm seeing here and that I can see outside, I feel like there's a message here. Um, there might be someone who doesn't have the best intentions here for you that you have to look out for, that you need to be wary of. Um, I do feel like someone does want to help you. Um, so, you know, appreciate and notice the help that's being given and the help that's being received because that five of pentacles is here. Um, I feel like this energy, whoever this person is, they could make you happy. Now, the Two of Wands and the Two of Swords, there is a decision that you need to make. I see a decision between two options that are coming up around you. Uh, so it's like a decision you need to make between two different people, two different connections um, entirely. I feel like this is also that back and forth that you've been in. You've been in two minds. Um, and I feel like your patience is being tested. Okay, I feel like someone is definitely testing your patience and they're skating on thin ice with you I feel like you're getting to a point where you no longer sort of want to put up with that energy you, I think you're over dealing with that ten of wands I think you're over doing all that hard work like emotionally you've invested so much and to not get things in return or to have things be so back and forth like it's it's putting you off if I'm completely honest it's putting you off and it's either leading you to look to other people but I feel like an outcome is coming I do feel like I'm really drawn to that rainbow um and it's a good sign. It's an auspicious sign. Um, and I feel like a promise is going to be fulfilled. I'm get that I get that there's like a someone owes you something. Um, and I feel like that's going to be fulfilled for you. It's something you've sort of uh, been looking forward to. But yeah, that's 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 going to be fulfilled. I think. I think you've been owed this for quite some time. I feel like this reading is all over the place, if I'm completely honest. I feel like I feel like there's so many messages coming through about so many different things, and I get that that's probably what you're going through, because right now I get that there's so many roads, so many different options. There's a lot happening. It's like one thing depends on the other. If this happens, then that will happen. If that doesn't happen, then that option goes away. Like I just feel like you're sorting things out and you're sifting through things in that way, and that's why I'm just like... And, you know, I find it auspicious, like I'm seeing these crows and uh, magpies outside and then I can see the crows here and I feel like this is your energy right now. It's just, there's so many different thoughts, there's so many different messages, birds are messengers. So I feel like there's going to be a lot of communication coming in, but it's from a lot of different channels and it's regarding a lot of different things. So hang in there and be patient, I think, because you do have that outcome, that rainbow is coming that rainbow that, that the universe owes you is definitely coming your way air sign so just hang in there for me i'm there with you along the way um and uh yeah hopefully that does make sense drop a like if it does subscribe that'd be amazing um and i'm sure we'll catch up very soon so have a lovely week everyone and bye for now